Hello everyone, I am Jessofe Palerco Bazen and I am making a physics DIY video experiment. So bear with me through all the video because you will be amazed with it as long as you've watched it. Number one, air pressure can crush it. In this video, all you're gonna need are tongs to hold the can and avoid contact with heat. An empty can. Put some generous 1 tablespoon of water onto the empty can. A basin with ice cubes or just some ice crush. A glove for you to avoid contact with heat. This is not necessary. And eyeglasses would help to protect your eyes from splatters. Procedures Open your gas stove. Another info I would like to give you is you must use a gas mask to avoid inhaling harmful, harmful substances in the air. Okay, continue. Hold your can above the gas stove's burner with the fire set to mid-high within 2 minutes. After 2 minutes, do not hesitate to put the, heat, the heated empty can into the basin. The reaction takes place. As you can see, the can literally imploded. The can is filled with water and air. The sudden collapsing of an object toward its center is called implosion. It is in state of equilibrium or balance. To make the internal pressure of the can balance with the external pressure on the can, the can implodes. Number 2 Vacuum Attack In this experiment, I will show you how to make a vacuum steam vacuum. So these are the materials you needed to project. Get some ice and crush it. Put it on the prepared basin with a water. Get a bowl filled with water. Mix a powder with color so that it will help you to recognize the water in a bottle. Place a pot with water on the stove to boil it. When it gets on its boiling point, place the hot water on to the empty cap bottle. Wait some seconds. Place the hot water into the empty cap and wait some seconds. And use the gloves to flip the empty bottle and throw the hot water out. Quickly place the empty bottle upside down while it was hot. As you can see, when you submerge your bottle under water, it, ap it applies pressure to the bottom. In this case, the heat was not enough to make a greater force for the water to rush inside the bottle. You can still make a better one by yourself. Good luck! In this case, for you to achieve a greater output, you can still make another one by adding clay and a straw. Number 3 Toy electric DC motor, Dynamo. The materials you needed in this experiment are a shoe glue, a magnet, an electrical tape, fan is not necessary, Alp two alpillers, a plier, a scissor. Don't forget to prepare some magnet magnetic wire size 18. So let's begin the procedure. Cut some magnetic wire and roll it on a circular object in 18 turns. Make a knot on the circular magnetic wire that you made so that it won't scatter. The, the video will provide you the information to make your own DZ motor dynamo.
final output will explain the works of a dynamo motor. Here shows the magnetic wire as the motor and the battery as the generator. The armature is placed between two permanent magnets which produce a magnetic field that causes the motor to be in a state of rest due to the e equal action of opposing forces. That's all. God bless.